all right guys so in this video i will show you how you can use your dedicated graphic card i mean your nvidia graphic card to render your each and every video in your premiere pro or you can how you can use this graphic card to play back the videos in premiere pro so with that being said let me just start this video and i, I will show you how you can just use your dedicated graphic card that means nvidia geforce graphic card whichever you have how you can use this to render your videos in premiere pro so with that being said let's get started what you need to do is just click on project project settings and click on journal so when you click on journal it will show you some settings okay now you can see the renderer now in this case i will i only have the integrated graphic card as you can see i cannot select anything but that's all fine just click on cancel okay now i will do the settings to use my dedicated graphic card that means nvidia graphic card to use to render each and every video in Premiere Pro. For that, you need to click on C drive. Okay. Now you need to click on the program files. Yes, that folder. Okay, now you need to find Adobe. It will be on the first. Click on Adobe. That's all. Now you need to click on the Adobe Premiere Pro CS6. Yeah, that one. Okay, click on that. Now you need to find Suda. Okay, there are so many files over here. So now you need to search Suda on this folder. So let me search this for you guys. C U D A. Let me type it this for you. C U D A. Now click on enter. When you click on enter, you will see only one file over there. Suda supported cards. So you need to click on that and open this file. So when you open this file, you will see 21 graphic cards are there, which is supported. But in case your graphic card is not supported so you need to type that graphic card name over here so now let's find out your graphic card name so some of you guys maybe don't know what graphic card name is your PC belongs so you need to click on run and when you click on run you need to type DX Dike. so DX D I A G and when you type this click on OK okay so when you click on OK you will see the screen okay when you see the screen click on render okay now the main thing is copy and paste this chip type on the notepad remember it's case sensitive you need to type exactly as same like this which is shown on the chip type okay so I will do one thing I will copy this thing and paste it over here okay and now rename this my is GeForce GTX 850M so when I type this I need to save this file control s so save this file so when you save this file just close this as I'm doing right now just close this file okay now close this too and even this okay now you need to restart your Adobe Premiere Pro so just open this thing and close it and you need to open it again I mean you need to restart this thing so as I have closed this now I have to open this thing let me open it again so it will take some time to open this thing okay when it open just open your project it is loading right now so there are so many files have been turned green so let's see the settings project settings general and up here we get the GPU acceleration suda so now our graphic card is enabled and we can use this graphic card to render each and every video in our Premiere Pro so so when you use this graphic card it will load faster and it will work faster than your integrated graphic card so my nvidia graphic card is using right now so each and every video will be playback faster than ever it will be fast five times more than integrated graphic card so that's all for my video boys if and girls if you like this video you can go ahead and like if you have any questions just comment down that's all for the video guys my name is booster minds and i'm signing out right now